Hey everyone, welcome to a new episode of the Interactive Tank Build. Uh, I'm going to be shooting these videos in between the main videos on my phone so and posting them on YouTube. Um, it's actually a lot quicker for me to do this than go ahead and shoot a full video, edit it, and then send it to YouTube. But just wanted to show you what I did today. Um, nothing really major in the tank, everything's still the same, the sand bed is still the same. Um, wanted to get all your responses back for everything uh, on what to do next because I do have the sand right there and the light and everything it's it's just sitting there now the fish are doing fine um, I did one thing today I promised you guys that I'll do a full testing on the tank and what I did is I used all of my test kits I have some ELOs some APIs and uh, test kits and stuff like that. I did calcium, magnesium, nitrate, phosphate, KH, pH, and I got all the results. I write, I wrote them down here, and there we go. The salinity is 1.026. Phosphates are sitting at zero. Nitrates are at zero. Calcium, I think it's a bit high, but some people could argue otherwise. It's at 580. Magnesium is 1350. I think that's a little bit low. DKH is 5. I think that's low too. And pH is sitting around 8.0, like 8, between 8.0 and 8.1. So that could be raised up a little bit as well. I just wanted to show you guys what the results were on that. But other than that, that's what's going on over here. Tank parameters are pretty good, everything's stable. Um, I've been getting a lot of your comments on reef pillars, putting all the rocks to the side, adding more rocks. Um, I'm still not getting what I actually wanted you guys to do from this is to, like kind of interact with each other and uh, decide what to do because I'm getting scattered information from you, all of you guys and um, if I listen to one of you and it doesn't really agree with another one, um, I might, you, you guys might not want that to happen. So I want you all to just uh, comment with each other, um, come up with an idea on what to do next, and I will do it. So I hope uh, more of you actually will join in. I haven't really gotten um, many responses yet um, it's just a few people that are actually um, interacting in this but um, hopefully I will get more people to get involved as well but for now this is what's going on um, haven't really added the sand yet uh, I should be adding it slowly I think that's I think that might be the best way to do it because there are uh, many um, creatures living in there um, there are some worms, stuff living in there. Also, I have hermit crabs that are all around the sand and around the rocks and stuff, so I really don't want to kill any of those off, and as well, all of the snails. So anyways, I, I will post um, the results also in the description, so you don't have to keep um, rewinding back to where the results were. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Um, hopefully I'll get more comments and feedback from you guys. And I'll see you guys later.